All right, week four, got the Cardinals. Now we beat them last year. They're a better team than they were last year. And we're a better team than we were last year. And we're coming off a great win off of Cincinnati. And you know, they're talking about how great Jaden is and all the streaks about all the possessions and stuff. Look, if we throw an interception today, cool. If we punt today, cool. I just want to win. Look, I'm still a beaten down Commanders fan. I just want to win. I don't care how we win. I just want to win. And maybe defense will show up this week. I don't know. Also, I drove back. I could have been at Bush Gardens today, but I drove back after my 5K because I'm actually excited to watch the team for the first time in my life. Well, the first drive, we can still see we cannot stop the run. Even the announcers are calling out how our defense is doing. This is sad. And the Cardinals score a touchdown to Marvin Harrison Jr. You I'd get, I'd get afraid because now we're playing from behind, but this is exactly how it started in Cincinnati last week. Drove down, scored a touchdown. Well, they didn't really drive down. They kind of did Jamar Chase. But they went, scored a touchdown, and then we answered back. So, as long as we can get something going on offense, I think we'll be pretty good. Ooh, third down Jane to Zacchaeus? B-Rob takes it around the outside, and B-Rob ain't going to take it out of bounds. He's going to turn in bounds, lower his shoulder, and break the pain. Ooh, a B-Rob direct snap. No, I like that. And a B-Rob touchdown. That was the B-Rob drive right there. Nothing better than a B-Rob tutty. We're making James Conner look like prime David Johnson. Come on, let's stop him. Well, I've come to learn the best way our pass defense can stop anyone is if the quarterback overthrows him. Beautiful toe tap on the sideline by Terry. Dermot McNichols to the outside. He's going. Touchdown, McNichols. B-Rob, Eckler, McNichols, three-headed monster, we got freaking Cerberus in the backfield. So we weren't already terrifying on offense. Now we have a third running back that's very good. Defense actually stopped him. Jane throws deep. He threw an interception. I didn't know he was capable of doing that. But you know, that's a good thing. Get the pressure off. Get your first interception out the way. Now let's just see how the defense reacts. And the defense sacks Kyler Murray? Durant Armstrong has come out to be our best defensive lineman this season. And the defense did another stop and we got the ball back. Hey, look, there's Trey Sway. He's punting. I forgot that we did that. You know, I don't like punting, but it, there is nothing like seeing a good old Trey Sway booming the ball downfield. I mean, there's just nothing like it. What a stand by our defense on fourth down. Was that Durant Armstrong again? Okay. We get the ball to end the half. All right, awesome, Siebert. Come on. Come on. That thing looked like it was going a couple different directions, but it went through the middle, and that's what's important. And I think in all the hype that we have a quarterback now, which is amazing, don't get me wrong, I think we are losing a little bit of side effect. We have a kicker now. And now we get the ball to start the half. Love to see us get a scoring drive here. Jaden goes deep to Noah Brown. He over th overthrows him? <gasps> are we getting a DPI? We never get those. First and goal, baby. First and goal. Jaden takes it to the outside. Leaps into the end zone. Jane Daniels, a Russian tutty. Let's freaking go. Look at the offensive line. They're blocking. I'm sorry. I, after last season, I forgot that's what they're supposed to do. I thought they were just supposed to fall to the ground and let a quarterback get hit. 24 to 7 in the third quarter. I've never had days like these. And the defense did another stop. I mean, come on. Fourth and one, we go for it, we give it to McNichols. And McNichols cuts it to the outside for like 15 yards? You know, it's funny, like with our running game and our line, it's like when you need like two yards, it's like you just put one of the running backs back there, like B-Rob or McNichols, and you just like press a button and you say, run. And you get and you get like automatic yards. And also Seabird sinks it through for another field goal, 27 to seven? What is this team, bro? There's our defense, there they are. James Conner right up the middle for like 20. Fourth and 12, there's no way we let them convert this, right? Yeah, Marvin Harrison to the outside. Yep, yep, mm-hmm, yeah. Knew that was coming. James Conner up the middle for a touchdown. Which is fine, because I got him in fantasy. And in another league, my opponent has him. So double-edged sword. We're still up 13. Now let's score again to make the score even prettier. Jane rolled out, ran, and slid again. That's two weeks and two slides. Literally the one thing he had to improve on he improved. A beautiful throw to Luke McCaffrey. Touchdown to Scary Cherry. Let's go. He's got to let him and Jaden get it going, bro. You got to let them, you know, dab each other up, say, bro, I got you. I'm sure Taylor Heineke probably gave Jaden a call and said, hey, buddy, look, sometimes you just need to close your eyes and say, hey, screw it, Terry's down there somewhere, and just throw it. Terry will probably catch it. And Zach Ertz gets a two-point. Good to see Zach Ertz get a little end zone action playing against his former team. Cliff Kingsbury in this revenge game is absolutely dialing it up. Oh, big pass. Wait, we forced a fumble? And Frankie Lubu got on it? Let's go. Defense forces a turnover. McNichols gets it up the middle. And that's another touchdown. 
we did a 40 burner. And we win 42-14. Beautiful score. I mean, we haven't had a score of that beautiful in so long. We put over 30 points two games straight. This is fantastic. I have never experienced being a fan of this team like this. Like, I've never experienced winning like this. I don't know what this feels like. I don't know what this is supposed to be like. Like, I just found out yesterday that I'm allowed to breathe when watching our football games because you have to hold my breath for three hours straight. But now I can actually just, <sighs> when our offense is on the field. And then I get humbled when our defense is on the field. But then the defense played good today. Turnover, Durant Armstrong with two sacks. Deron Payne had a sack. John Allen had a sack. We are firing on all cylinders. Special teams plays good. Outside of the opening kick return, but outside of the opening kick return, we were so good on special teams. Tressway even got a little action today. Good to see him still out there. Seabird straining kicks. Jane's playing out of his mind. Terry's getting involved. We got another running back. We're an actually good football team. And we're head of division. Three and one. But only one thing left. Left hands up. Who are we? The Commanders. Let's get it. Let's go. Oh.